Hello and welcome back to our channel. Managing recurring invoices and automating payments can save your business time and effort. In today's tutorial, we'll walk you through the step-by-step -step process of setting up recurring invoices and using AutoPay in QuickBooks Online. This will help you streamline your billing process and get paid faster. But before we jump into the action, if you're new here, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you never miss out on our latest adventures. And it keeps you on the loop for future content. And to our returning viewers, welcome back and we appreciate your ongoing support and cannot wait to embark you on this journey with all of you once again on board. Now let's get right into it. Okay, so... Setting up recurring invoices and using AutoPay in QBO offers several advantages for businesses and making the billing and payment process more efficient and reliable. So, consistently, it will reduce the risk of missed payments or billing errors, saving you time compared to manually creating invoices for repeat customers, right? These are for a bit business, repeat clients, repeat customers, right? You can also predict your future revenue more accurately because it's a repeat business which is essential for financial planning and budgeting. Customers really appreciate consistent billing practices which can enhance their trust in your business and lead to um, you know, a better, healthy, long-term relationships. Automating recurring billing reduces the administrative workload allowing you to focus on other aspects of your business. And it can also be customized to fit various billing frequencies and schedules, accommodating different customer needs. Now, if we are, are referring to using the AutoPay, AutoPay essentially accelerates the payment process, ensuring that you receive payments promptly, which can improve your cash flow. AutoPay also reduces the risk of late or missed payments because, you know, payments are automatically initiated according to the set schedule. You spend less time and effort in chasing down payments and sending reminders as AutoPay handles payment collections for you. Customers benefit from that because the convenience of AutoPay is that they don't need to remember payment due rates or manually make payments. AutoPay can lower payment processing costs compared to uh, traditional payment methods such as checks. AutoPay transactions are often highly secure, reducing the risk of payment fraud or unauthorized access to um, sensitive financial information. Knowing when payments will be received allows for better financial planning and budgeting, which is also essential for business stability. So in general, AutoPay transactions are automatically recorded, simplifying the uh, reconciliation process and reducing the manual risk. Okay, now... If you are using the same version that I have, your dashboard should look just like here. And you go to a new, it's where it says customers and invoice, right? And then since we have a limited options here, um, in, in, if you have an, a life account or a customer information, basically there's an option below here below on the right the customization the payment options design automation and record recurring invoice here all you gotta do is click that option the recurring invoice and then when you click the recurring invoice option here below you will be prompted to a different uh, uh window that you will be asked to enter the the name the scheduled type you know is it going to be a schedule is going to be a reminder or unscheduled it depends really on your uh preference and you will also ask by the by the days in advance the the payment methods the billing address and all that just to make sure and then if you are satisfied there's also you can also check the interval is it monthly is it weekly or day by day it, also, it will also give you the start date, the end date, and whatnot. And you can also uh, create some uh, minute details like the description, the product services, the amount, and the tax rate, and all that stuff. And when you are sure and finish, 
just click the save and send and you will be automatically reverted back to the recurring invoice that you just created and how cool is that and thank you for joining us today if you find this tutorial helpful don't forget to give it a thumbs up subscribe to our channel for more quickbooks online tutorial and leave any questions or feedback in the comments below uh, we are we love reading your comments and it makes us happy that our loyal subscribers are relentlessly um, sharing our media links to different social media platforms to their friends, family, and colleagues. So, you know, it makes our community bigger each and every day. So we are we can never be thankful enough to to be appreciative of what you are doing for us, guys. And until next time, happy bookkeeping. So see you guys again in the next video. Peace.